that's very romantic, Larry, but it's not gonna happen. <laughs> my best friend is two feet away, weeping on our couch. Oh my god! You are beautiful and smart and creative. I know. Lynn, you stay as long as you want. Quiet! Very cute. Funny, smart. Lynn, you haven't even met him yet. Give him a chance. talk to him. Uh, Nelson, this chair is uneven. Can you do me a favor and eat two inches off this leg? Look, Nelson, I think you're trying too hard. Really? Yeah, relax. You're a great guy. You're smart and funny and cute. Cute? Oh, I mean handsome. You've got must be good looks like James Spader. You think so? Absolutely. Uh, well, sometimes it can hurt. Do you know some? Fool. Nelson, this can't happen. Oh. Really, he kind of has a point. What? evening of discussion and song. My husband and I had a great time. Didn't be there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I think she's got us there. Honey, you're gonna love the gifted and talented program. Mrs. Falvey's coming by tomorrow morning for the interview. Oh, great. It's awesome. Hmm, these flowers are pretty. Where did they come from? Um, I picked them. Really? You did? Yep. Excuse me for wanting to make things look beautiful around here. She's in a weird mood. Um, Dusseldorf, the powerhouse of industrial gym. Winter, come on. Going to the rave. The rave? I heard some older kids talking about it. <laughs> And since you're such good friends with them, it would be really easy for you to bring them. Like Blake brought the MGM lot. But Donkey, why didn't you just promise him Justin Timberlake? So you being friends with Donkey, that was just a lie? It's okay. Thanks. Guess you don't really know any celebrities. 